everybody, it is Kellax in here. If you guys enjoyed this video, remember that you guys should become patrons over on Patreon if you guys want to support us. So today, we are talking about Jin. Okay, so if you guys don't know, a couple, like last year, right, I made a theory and it at was the titled, of, uh, of the, not, I think it was before we found the relic, like it was a couple episodes before it ended, and okay. we made a video Around and it was called, place. hey, follow me, follow me. the relics, are, the relics aren't relics, they're people, right, that was kind of, the, the idea was is that there was something inside of the relic, that the relic was still an object, but there was a genie. And, and at there, the time I was like, that's the dumbest idea I've ever seen. Uh-huh. What a... And so yeah. I kind of just like had this theory at the back of my mind. We sort of stuck with this theory for a while. You guys can look for the video if you guys want to still and see it. And Abuela then I thought Maria was... was the relic genie, the, uh, the grandma, right? And then she wasn't, and I was like, you idiot. You thought there was going to be a genie in the lamp? What kind of ridiculous... But then, Judgment Day came, and yeah. all of you fuckers... <laughs> got reckoned, okay? Because there was one. It wasn't Abuela, but it was the lady in the statue who we said was the relic person in that video, okay? Because you, you if were, you guys know, you I'm gonna I'm gonna put in a screenshot. I'm gonna put in a screenshot right now of that video. So of that video, right, you guys can see what it's titled, and you guys can see, you know, the 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 statue is in the thumbnail, okay? And y'all all thought I was fucking crazy. But we weren't, and Jin was in the relic, and she was in the statue, and I want a written apology from all y'all who doubted me, okay? Because we are the Ruby Prophets, all right? Hunter knew that Ilya was gay before she even said a word, okay? I we guessed so that. many stuff that right. And so this is a W. This is a big fat W for me today. I think. And we have a couple other W's, but they're little W's, and we'll get to those later. But this is the biggest W, because literally no one said this, and people were like, Cal is fucking crazy. But now, who's laughing? It's me. So anyway. And y'all, if this is your first video of mine that you guys are seeing, like, I'm not this, like, petty and vindictive all the time. So you see that right? smile that's on This smile that's is not rare. A this smile. Is <laughs> that's not a, like, because I've seen Cal be like, I hate everyone. Hi, guys. No, this is, this is, this is genuine love for life. <laughs> because, you okay, mouse, I said this like, a couple, a couple of weeks ago. Rule, you want to, you want to conquer the world Alright, I said now. this a couple of videos ago, but I, I'm so sad, guys. And sometimes I wake up and I'm like, what the I've fuck are we doing? I've seen your Twitter account. Like, I know what are we you're... doing this all for, okay? But this, this is why. Because I can now say I was one of the first people, if not the first, to say this theory and get it correct. And Jin is fucking wonderful. I would fuck her all day long. She's very sexy, even though she has no nipples. And I love her personality, and even though we just saw her right now. And also not genitalia, because you just kind of see her yeah. crotch for a moment. But she's definitely the person from the statue. You. Right. If I remember correctly, yeah. She because was. I'm gonna put. A, I remember chains. Kind yeah, of I'm gonna put a picture of her in the thumbnail, right? You, you but didn't if you, check? Huh? No, I did check. Okay. But if you guys see our video, like that, I already posted I on screen. I was about to say, like, I understand that you're feeling yourself right now, but you might want to like check your sources. No, 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 I checked that. it. But um, if you guys, again, if you guys saw our screenshot in the corner, probably this corner of uh like our video that had the thumbnail right you can see that our thumbnail is the woman in change and if you look at Jin who is in our thumbnail it's the same it's basically the same thing so I'm very content with myself and I love her she's so great and I want to protect her even though she's not really real so let's get to actually like the meat of this video I guess like she is somebody that the god of light appointed to serve this relic to, which ser I think no, to is, serve humanity. Well, to serve humanity, but to answer the questions of this relic, if that makes sense. Like, to be of, the... Of who has the relic? Yeah! The relic isn't asking questions. No, 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 I mean, like... You make it sound like... She is the, like, the, the spirit of the relic that is designated to answer questions of those who have the relic. Whatever they want every 100 years. And I like yeah. how they have the stipulation of 100 years. And Austin's like, I used all of them, and then he didn't. So, he, okay, so that's what I love about here's it. What it I'm tells thinking. a story there. So can I... Because it tells a story. Because he Go ahead. lied about... So, like, they wouldn't even be tempted. Maybe he was worried about that. But then again, he only asked one question so what was that question what here's what i'm thinking what Are what, you ready? what did he learn what scared him that that's he what i'm saying yes so that was what i was just about to say and i'm glad i didn't interrupt you because we're on the same train of thought but 
That's what I was thinking. This is the first time you've made like interhuman connection with me. Like in that's months. what I'm saying. You're just like I'm, you're, you're suddenly you've become a human again. I'm Continue. saying that Oddspin must have asked something that was so scary mm -hmm. that he just didn't want to ask any more questions, or he decided to save the other two for later. But I think something scared him off from using it, definitely. And he said no, like he doesn't want people to find out, right? And obviously, I love how it tells a story. Once upon a time, like she's a storyteller genie. And like, okay, so this is a little off topic, but related. I'm taking a fairy tales class this semester. And we've talked about how like the matriarch uh, of the family is usually the one telling the stories and like all of that stuff. And oh, okay. she's a female matriarch who is telling, it's reciting this fairy tale, right? And, like, I guess she's not a matriarch because she has, like, no family, but she's still a female... She's a female uh, she's a of power. Like, a female a woman, of power. A woman of power a woman, a woman and knowledge and, like, feminine. a storyteller. She's a really, feminine She doesn't spirit. really have a gender. She's not really a person. She's really just, like, a feminine... Well, she identifies as a woman. It's she is a kind of you know just I mean? an a feminine... Yeah. Uh, creature. Magic. Magic, yeah. But that's what I was kind of thinking when I saw her. I was like, this fits in with the idea of knowledge and retelling fairy tales so well, and I'm so happy. Like, I don't know if that was a conscious choice, like, to make her female, like, the particularly this relic, but it makes so god, much sense, right? right? So, she, like, well, she's usually... a spirit, right? Okay. The god of light was like, hey, go in there, and she was like, okay. Well, maybe he also, made what, her, what's right? her, What are the other uh, relics? Destruction, choice, and creation. So I'm guessing creation, creation is also the god of light. Oh, Okay. What do you mean? Oh, Cause right, because maybe I'm saying they got two each, right? Destruction oh. probably is oh. the god of darkness, and then choice is was, probably the god of darkness. I was as well. going off whether or not they were maternal or paternal gods, oh. so I thought like destruction. Well, the and two war gods are brothers, yeah. so I'm saying that okay. the other relics. Well, it kind of ties in uh, with what you're saying. I'm saying knowledge I, and uh, creation are probably both light, and then choice and destruction are probably both dark. But then maybe it's equal. Like two of them are men and two of them are women. Like you're kind of saying, yes. like choice is men. Being because it's sort of the biblical maybe idea of like the snake the serpent like it's a dude maybe. right yeah, and then the good. idea of destruction, destruction war famine, mars usually dudes. you know greek Horsemen, greek stuff roman mythology creation you know persephone yeah, uh sort of like uh, persephone and demeter is that her mother i don't remember it's been a hot minute since so, I brushed so up on my greek gods. mythology so there's probably yeah. there might be well dude spirits right they're not gods genies genies so two lady genies. genies, two dude genies. Yeah, maybe. We don't really know. But I'm just, I'm so here for her right now. And she has I such a nice her. voice. And she's like, nice Who to see you again, voice? old man. Uh, like, yeah, it's like, also like she knows and she calls him old man. Yeah, even she knows, though, right? Even though he's a little kid. And you know, he has, she has personality even though she's just a spirit. Like in her yeah, body language and how she talks. She's a little sassy, right? <laughs> Could you imagine if Ren saw this now? Like, it's not a genie, and like, get fucked, Ren! Like, no! Like, it is a genie, right? Like, uh, Nora would just be, it would be, Nora would be, would be like, fuck you! Everyone like, Nora would be, would be silent, right and Nora would just be, fuck you, Ren! I'm like, okay. Mood, that's like me. That's just me. No, that is you. I know. That is I, I've drank some G Fuel energy just to get me through the day. I don't know if I needed it, but like, I don't I think, think I, I needed need it, it now. I probably will need it more than you. Chug, chug, chug. No. Chug, chug, but yeah, chug, I'm chug, so chug. excited to see what they do with this just because I feel like that's so cool that like the genie is telling the story and then the other genies and the other relics. So we kind of know what to expect and maybe we know what to look for. But maybe the other ones aren't even human spirits. Right? Because they don't need to necessarily Maybe they be have people. different colors. Because I love how the first yeah, genie blue. was blue, like genie from Aladdin. Yeah. Like, I made the obvious, like, you ain't never had a friend like me. I think... Joke, but... Here's kind of what I think about that, is that, like, what if some of them are animals? You know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah, maybe. the destruction may be... I don't want to say, like, a crow, because that doesn't make any sense, no, but, like, destruction not... could be... But then again, you like, know knowledge I mean? and, like, Or choice could be hour. the snake, right? Like, a snake spirit. So oh, maybe, maybe it's, like, animal and or people and just faunus, like... right? Like, maybe it's just a mixture of spirits. It doesn't necessarily need to be human. Also, who created faunus again? Was, they they both did it. At the same time? Yeah. Okay. Because they made humanity, and faunus are just sort of an offshoot of humans, right? That's, that's true. So me, I don't know. Maybe the they were just having some fun. Like, <laughs> let's give them some animal treats. What if, like they were both just like wasting. They're like, what if, what if we? 
We gave one cat ears. <laughs> I yeah. just imagine that would be a Well, because they worked together to make humanity, and Faunus yeah. are still humans, so I'm guessing it was either the Dark God was like, okay, but can we make some cool humans? And they were like, okay. All right, we made Fine. a mermaid. Fine. Like, we made a mermaid. Right. Okay, all that. Because, go. oh, and that's the other thing, right? The Dark God made the Grimm, and all of the Grimm are based off of creatures of mythology, mm -hmm. while everybody else in the world is basically human. Like, we don't see flesh and blood dragons. We don't see necessarily like flesh mermaids right it's just a fish faunus by virtue of like mm -hmm. that looks like what we would understand as a mermaid so i'm thinking that with the dark god maybe he did something more mythical with the spirits mm. right like maybe he because if the grim are all supposed to be what we understand as mythical creatures you could have creatures that are like the centaur or the this or the that you know what i mean mm -hmm. you get that because like, when you think about it, like, there are no flesh and blood dragons. There may not be any flesh and blood stinks, sphinxes or manticores. Like, all of the grim are based off of, like, creatures of mythology while humans are just sort of human. And there's no, like, flesh and blood equivalent. Like, there's no flesh dragon that's a good dragon. Not yet, anyway. And so I think that that's sort of they interesting to think about. They just kind of brought up that dragon in Volume 3 and never did much with it. We don't so need to knows. worry about that, but yeah. I feel like this video's done. I'm just really excited to see what they do uh, with I'm her. So I'm so excited she, to hear her tell the fun. story. I love how... I love, I love how, her dark hair, too. I also love how they tell the story, how it's in white. Once and upon how a how it's time. all very, like... Like, it's like you a feel fairy like you're tale. in the same room, but no, how they do the white and how it feels oh. like they're in the same room, yeah, but yeah, they're yeah. moving around and crows like, where the fuck is everybody? That sort of reminds me. And then me... how everything is sort of created. Is as it, it Black Mirror? I don't think that's right. But there was a show that sort of did that with memories. Maybe it was Black Mirror. Like, I know Black Mirror has a thing where you rewind the, oh, San Junipero. How it sort of places you into, I mean, obviously they're dead, so it's a little different, but the San Junipero episode of Black Mirror, if you guys don't know, they are, like, dying people sort of using I mean, the virtual yeah, reality and they're stored in the cloud, youth. exactly, and so, but this, this one, is different, this obviously, is but that's mystical. what it reminds me of. It reminds me of, I don't know why it reminds me of Epic Mickey, but you know how an Epic yeah! Mickey is like, created? Yeah, it reminds me of Epic like Mickey, this. how the castle is like, created. This is such a fun video, I love you guys, I'm so happy, look at me. You, like, you went at me from, right like, now. fuck all these bitches who don't like it, they're goddesses. Like, you're just so happy now. I know. It's like, why can I'm you sorry. be like this all the time? I know. Anyways. Anyways. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and we will see you guys later. Bye! Thank you guys for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed, I encourage you guys to become patrons over on Patreon. Uh, patrons get a lot of different rewards, ranging from early access to all of our videos up to a week in advance. Uh, $10 patrons actually get them sometimes weeks in advance, or even like a month in advance. It depends on how much uh, we record for. Uh, but also, all of our patrons get access to our Discord server, which is really cool if you guys uh, want to talk to us in a more direct way. Uh, I obviously hang out a lot there. And there are just a bunch of other rewards that you guys can uh, check out on Patreon, you guys can sort of see for yourself, and if you want to support us, you want to help us out, you want to see more videos like this and want to help keep us going, uh, you guys uh, would uh, really help us out. So yeah, I hope uh, that you guys uh, will consider becoming patrons, and I hope that all of our patrons uh, enjoy seeing their lovely names at the end of the screen, because we couldn't do this without them. So uh, I will see you guys later. Bye.